Hello all my Facebook buddies and YouTube buddies. I'm the owner and creator of the HDTV Antenna Cut Your Cable group on uh, Facebook. I'm doing a uh, video here of trips to Barry Richmond Hill, which is in the GTA area, and downtown Toronto. We're using two types of antennas, the uh, Fossman, which is unamplified antenna, and the other one, uh, which was sent to me by uh, a Mr. Chen, uh, is the wind amplified antenna. And we're doing tests to see which is the better antenna. So I will see you uh, once we get to Barry. Okay, back again. I just want to give you a rundown on some of the equipment that we're uh, taking with us which is the first thing here is the seven inch uh, portable uh, TV and then here is the uh, Fossman unamplified antenna this is the wind antenna uh, the amplified antenna that Mr. Chen gave me from China now this part here is the amplifier this is the USB which plugs into the USB port of the TV and it feeds off the power of the TV to amplify uh, the antenna which should bring in excellent signals so we're going to uh, check to see if this amplified antenna works as good or even better as that uh, unamplified antenna okay we'll see you in Barrie okay we're in the town of Barrie uh, over across those trees there you'll see that's Lake Simcoe uh, we've got a population here of about 145,000 and we're going to see if we can pick up any TV stations uh, in this area so wish me luck okay here again we're by the lake and this is CKVR TV uh, CTV on uh, CTV2 and again no matter where you go in Barrie it, it appears you can only get the one channel this place is not high enough anywhere to uh, pick any of these other channels up yeah now as you see the city of Barrie is like any other city too many high-rise buildings to be able to do anything if I was able again to a high-rise department to be able to test these antennas out properly here and then things might have been a different story okay so hopefully the next location I go to I'll be able to find a higher place and line of sight where I will get better success We were right at Lake Simcoe. We should have been picking up stations in Aurelia, Midland, and Huntsville. And I was very disappointed because it should have been easy to get uh, at least another three more stations besides CKVR. So it was a very big disappointment. So the next place we're going to, which I was told, is the Georgian Mall, which is the highest point in the city of Barrie. So let's hope we have better luck up there. Okay, we're now at the highest point of Barry, and unfortunately, it's a bust because we can only pick up one channel here. There's nothing really in line of sight where it's allowing me to pick up more than one channel, which is just CKVR and Barry, which is CTV2. Hopefully, my next location is going to be uh, a better success. Okay, in the city of Barrie, the highest point was Georgian Mall, which was a big disappointment. We should have gotten stations in Toronto. Aurelia, Huntsville, and Midland. Now, according to my calculations, we should have been getting 15 to 20 channels. So, it was a very big disappointment. And we only used the one antenna, which was the uh, wind antenna. There's no sense using the uh, Fossman, because only picking up one channel with both antennas is not really much of a contest. So, I hope in our next location, we're going to have better luck. This is the RCA TV that I bought last year when I went to the Sci-Fi Convention in uh, Toronto. We're taking uh, this set with us uh, to Richmond Hill in Toronto to see how well it performs uh, with the other set. Now, the only thing is, 
we can only use the web. Apparently there's a way to use an external antenna, but I don't think uh, this set will fit uh, these type of antennas that we're testing. Okay, so next stop is Richmond Hill Center. We'll see you there. Okay, now I'm using the Fossman antenna, which is not amplified, and we can only get one station with this uh, antenna, which is uh, CBLT CBC in Toronto. Okay, now we're going to try the wind antenna uh, with the amplifier and see if that uh, is any better. Okay, now we've hooked up the amplifier well, I mean, antenna and it says we're bringing in 13 stations. So, that's uh, CBC in Toronto. Okay, it's City TV. Just $69.99 a month. Omni. Call one, one of the Omni today. stations. Done by okay. standard Global 41.2, which is standard definition. But he was a, spending, you know, more Global 41.1 high definition. Back to the United States. Were you optimistic and, and excited to hear about that? Absolutely. Okay, this is another Omni station. Okay, I'm not sure where this 38.6 is coming from. Uh, oh, this might be down in Hamilton. Uh, let's just have a look. Okay, so is this down in from Hamilton? I'll uh, bring up the antenna. Okay. Yeah, okay, that's not coming in very good from where I am. Okay. 38.5 I'm not sure what 38.5 is okay 38.4 38.3 okay this is 36.1 okay that's in Hamilton um, we're not really picking that up at the moment but it tells me it's there okay so it's actually recognized that station. Okay, this is CBC French. TV Ontario, which we're not really picking up here. Okay. Um, okay, this is Hamilton. Okay, we're not picking it up at the moment. But again, the antennas recognized it, okay, so which is good. This is channel 9, CTV in Toronto, which we're not picking up. And we're back to channel 5. Okay, so this amplified antenna is doing a lot better than the other one, which wasn't amplified. Thirty-eight point six. That's weird. I've checked through my charts and all my notes. There is no thirty-eight anywhere in the GTA area, or in Ontario, or in the Buffalo area. So, if anybody knows of a new channel thirty-eight that is opening up, uh, please drop me a note and uh, let me know uh, where it's coming from. Hmm. As you notice, with some of the Toronto stations and the Hamilton stations, the wind antenna is showing that the channels are there but there's no signal so I'm just wondering if anybody has any answers to how this happens because I would like to know here we go starting with the RCA uh, set it's only got a whip antenna but we've only got three uh, channels here is TV Ontario Okay, this is, I believe, Omni, one of the Omni stations. Okay, global high definition. Global standard definition. And City TV, which isn't coming in, but it did actually recognize the signal. Oh, yeah, here we go. City TV. 
is coming in and out, but it's not very strong uh, where I'm located at the moment. And we're back again to uh, TVO. <laughs> Sorry about that, folks. Technical difficulties, namely me. I didn't realize when I was doing the filming that I was going to come out sideways like that. But anyway, as you see with the RCA TV and whip, it's certainly doing better than that uh, leaf antenna, the Fossman. Okay, our next stop is uh, Spadina Park, right next door to Casa Loma. We're not allowed to film in Casa Loma, but I was told that uh, I can do the next lot of tests in the park beside them. Okay, I got the Fossman antenna out here now with uh, no amplifier. So right now we're getting channel five. Okay, global. No, that's in Hamilton. Not coming in very good. Channel thirty-six. C CTS. Okay. Now this is CBC French. Not in a very good location here. Okay. Okay, this is banana. TV Ontario. Okay, this is CTV in uh, Toronto, not coming in. Okay. okay, now we're back to channel 5. Let's see if I move the antenna around. 15 years of age. Maybe. Uh, well, I okay. To guilt and there was substantial evidence of him. All right, seems to be working when I put it up there now. So, yeah. let's try again. Okay, we got channel 9 now coming oh, in, CTV. Okay, now, TV Ontario. Okay, CBC French. Okay, not as good as what it was before. Yeah, it's breaking up a bit. Okay. This is this religious station, 36.1 in Hamilton, not coming in at the moment. Okay, we're back to channel 5. Now we're going to switch over to the wind so antenna, uh, amplified Connor, antenna. So give me a few minutes. Whoops! I did it again. Okay, now we've got the wind and, uh, amplified antenna, and this one which brought us in 11 channels. So this is CBC in Toronto. With some rain showers in okay, the forecast, then more sunshine after that as we kick off the weekend. Uh, the next seven. Okay. This is um, CHCH in Hamilton. TV Ontario, Toronto. No wait. CBC French, Toronto. Okay, so this is the religious station in uh, Hamilton. Okay, so this is one of the Omni channels in Toronto. Okay, this is Global High Definition Toronto. This is Global Standard Definition in Toronto. Okay, this is the other Omni uh, channel. And we've got City TV here in uh, Toronto. Okay, so as you see with this amplified antenna, it brings in a lot more stations than the other one. Uh, now, as you see, we're higher up um, in Toronto. We were able to bring in the Hamilton stations, not like when we were in the Richmond Hill Center. Hmm, now that's strange. There's three stations coming from Hamilton. We get CHCH TV 11, the super station. Uh, we also get CITS, the religious station. But I'm surprised we don't get CTV2, which is a relay from CKVR in Barrie. Okay, we're in a park here right beside Casa Loma. I wasn't allowed to do the documentary inside uh, Casa Loma. And that, so this is the highest point of Toronto now. Casa Loma was built in the 18th uh, century. That Rumor has it that uh, there's a secret passage inside the uh, castle and the person that was building it went broke and lost the castle. But as far as I know, the actual 
uh, secret passage only goes like a few hundred yards underground and this is the park where I'm going to be doing the uh, experiments with the antenna and I'm right here and I'm going to be looking for another location more open to see if I can pull in uh, more stations okay so stay tuned we'll be back shortly sorry about that we couldn't uh, show you uh, how well this RCA set uh, picked up out here in Spadina Park beside Castle Loma the batteries actually went dead on me so that was the end of that idea thanks folks for joining me in this video as you can see the wind antenna does run circles around the Fossman antenna if you're looking to buy an indoor antenna, I recommend you get the wind antenna. It's amplified and you won't be sorry as you can see the series of tests that was put in this video. If you're on YouTube, please vote and comment. And if you're watching this on Facebook, please comment and let me know what you thought of the video. Okay, until next time, you all have a good day. Bye.